Red Hat OpenShift 4 is the enterprise-ready Kubernetes platform with automated day two operations that empowers developers to innovate. To help organizations make the move from OpenShift 3 to take advantage of the features in OpenShift 4, Red Hat has released automated migration tools that make migration easier. These tools take advantage of leading open source projects and are woven together with a rich user interface to provide simplified and flexible workflows. With these tools, you can more easily export and import OpenShift 3 cluster resources to OpenShift 4, as well as migrate storage backends, like moving from Gluster to Ceph to maintain the persistent data your applications have created. The Control Plane Migration Assistance tool configures your new OpenShift cluster, matching when possible the settings in your source OpenShift 3 cluster. As the new OpenShift 4 cluster is spun up, you can use the Control Plane Migration Assistance tool to review which resources to apply. The new cluster is then ready to receive applications from the source cluster. Next, you'll create a migration plan. Red Hat's Cluster Application Migration Tool can migrate both stateful and stateless applications from the source cluster to the new cluster. Select the source cluster and namespaces you want to migrate and choose how to handle persistent volumes. When you run the migration plan, Kubernetes resources, internal images, and persistent volumes will be exported from the source cluster and imported to the new cluster. With Red Hat's migration tools, you can decide which applications to start with and which migration approach best fits each application. You can move persistent volumes directly, copy them using cloud snapshot capabilities, or do a file system copy when snapshots are not available. There's more than one way to migrate applications, and Red Hat provides comprehensive tools for multiple approaches. Simplify and accelerate your migration from OpenShift 3 to OpenShift 4 with Red Hat Migration Tools. Learn more. Contact us today.